I met him and I took a tour of the Watts Learning Center and there were all these pictures of um, kids in, the, in Africa at orphanages. And so I said, Gene, you know, you went to Africa, you raised money to get seven kids to go to Africa. What in the world were you thinking about going to orphanages? You know, I mean, most people go to Africa, you don't want to look at a giraffe, right? And uh, he goes, well, 95% of our kids are single parents. And so if those seven kids could meet kids who have no parents, they'd really appreciate their moms more. And I'm thinking, this guy has got it. He really gets how you create institutions and cultures. And, and I, just, I just knew I wanted to invest in him. He was really one of the, he and his wife, were two of the most amazing people. The Watts Learning Center has 350 kids, K through six. They randomly admit kids. They are the number one uh, KPI, uh, you know, key performance indicators or academic performance indicators in the state of California. Kids from Watts, 95% single parent or 92. Uh, they perform almost as well as PV High and Beverly Hills. K through six, random kid, you know, random selection. So they're not just taking the genius kids in the local area. They're taken, you know, through lottery. And it's just stunning that these kids without these opportunities. The same thing with foster care. 55% of the kids who go through the foster care program end up in drugs or prostitution or jail. So it's just this whole idea of you can create opportunity. I mean, as an entrepreneur, you can make a lot of money. You can have a great life, but you can create shit. You get to make jobs. You can make things happen. This guy, I mean, talk about changing lives. I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty inspiring. So, you know, you meet these people and it's just like, wow, this is, this guy's like a saint.